Open up your MTT, dated for today's date. The title of this video is Finding the Equation of the Line. The formula that we're going to be using is y equals mx plus b, m equals b equals. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to write our formula. So it's going to be y equals mx plus b, m equals b equals. So the first thing that we need to do is find our m. Well, we know the formula for m is m is equal to y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to label, here's x1, y1. and x2, y2. We're going to do our substitution step. m is equal to 5 minus 0 over 4 minus 5. And so we're going to go ahead and we're going to get our m equals 5 over negative 1. Hampton rule says the negative has to go up in the numerator. So negative 5 over 1 is my m. So I'm going to go ahead and put negative 5 over 1. And now I need to find my b. So in order to find my b, I'm going to take my equation y is equal to mx plus b. Now I'm going to pick an ordered pair that doesn't have any negatives in it. So I'm going to go ahead and pick my first ordered pair. So my y is 0, my m is negative 5, and my x is 5 plus b. So now I'm going to solve for b. So I'm going to do 0 is equal to negative 25 plus b is b on the left, it's not, so we're going to do symmetrical. b plus negative 25 is equal to 0. We're going to 0 pair out the 25, so we're going to have b is equal to 25. So now I know what b is, it's 25. So my answer, the equation, is going to be y is equal to negative 5 over 1 x plus 25. And that's how I find my equation of the line. Let's do the next one. So we're finding the equation of the line. So we're going to start with our formula. As soon as we hear the words equation of the line, we write y is equal to mx plus b, m equals and b equals. All right? Now, I don't have to find m because they gave me m, so m is negative 2. So I just got less work to have to do. So now I have to find b. So to find b, I do y is equal to mx plus b. Now I only have one ordered pair, so that 6 is going to go in for the y, and the 0 is going to go in for the x. So I'm going to have 6 is equal to and my m is negative 2 times 0 plus b. So 6 is equal to 0 plus b. Is the b on the left? It's not, so I'm going to do symmetrical. b plus 0 is equal to 6. 0 pair out your 0. So b is equal to 6. So now I can write my equation. So my equation is y is equal to negative 2x plus 6, and that's my answer. Notice that my equation is always going to have an x and a y, or it's going to have at least one x or at least one y. All right, let's go to the next one. We're doing equation of the line. As soon as we hear equation of the line, we write y equals mx plus b, m equals b equals. So in this case, m is going to be 1 half. So I already know 1 half. I don't have to solve for it, but I do need to find b. So I'm going to write my equation, y is equal to mx plus b. My y is negative 3. 
my m is one half, and my x is negative two. So negative three is equal to one half times negative two plus b. So negative three is equal to negative one plus b. Is b on the left? It's not, so we're gonna do symmetrical. b plus negative one is equal to negative three. Zero pair out your one, so b is equal to negative two. So now I have the two pieces I need for my equation. So my equation is gonna be y is equal to one half x plus negative two, or y is equal to one half x minus two. Because remember when we have the plus negative, we have to have our or. So those would be both of my answers. All right, now y intercept, we have to translate that into an ordered pair. Every y intercept, the value for x is going to be zero, and then four is the value for y. So y intercept, x is zero, and then our y value is four. So we're finding the equation of the line. So we're gonna do y is equal to mx plus b, m equals b equals. Our slope we're given is zero, and now we're gonna solve for b. So we're gonna do y is equal to mx plus b. My y is gonna be four, my slope is going to be zero, and my x is going to be zero. So four is equal to zero times zero plus b. So b is equal to four, do our symmetrical, b is equal to four, so we'll put our four in. So we're going to do y is equal to zero x plus four, or y is equal to four, and that is our equation. All right, now we have an x-intercept. When we have an x-intercept, y is zero. So we're gonna find the equation of the line. As soon as we hear equation of the line, we write y is equal to mx plus b, m equals b equals. Our slope we're given is three, so now we're gonna solve for b. y is equal to mx plus b. Our y is going to be zero, our slope is going to be three, and our x value is gonna be two. So it's gonna be zero is equal to three times two plus b. So zero is equal to six plus b. Is the b on the left? It's not, so we're gonna do symmetrical. b plus six is zero. Zero pair out our six. b is equal to negative six, so now we have our negative six. So our equation of the line is gonna be y is equal to three x plus negative six, or y is equal to three x minus six. And those would be our two forms of the equation. And that's how you find the equation of a line.